reasons I took a shot with Sartorialist on top. The most likely favorite and the most likely winner probably is the three Smarty Foss, and that's my second choice in here. He's a deep closer that did run uh, second. The horse are now on the track for race six here at ASD. Kicks off pick three wagering. It's the first leg of the Assiniboia Downs Marathon Series. The race will cover a distance of a mile and one-eighth. The purse, $9,000. Number one is Farmhand, owned by Doug, Judy, and Carmen Mustard. Heather Totterick, trained by Doug Mustard with Chris Husbands. Two is Double Clutch, number the three, plus one, Stable and Jack Robertson, trained by Jack Robertson with Adolfo Morales. Three is Smarty Fawcett, owned and trained by Chad Torvel, Janine Smith, Seth the Rye. Four, Lukeva, owned and trained by John Moore with Tori Gandia. Five, Sarda Realist, owned and trained by Fred Rossin with Ronaldo Cumberbatch. Number six, Pentecost, stoned by the Aztec Thoroughbreds, trained by Ardell Sailor with Paul Nolan. Seven is Starpone, owned and trained by Dennis Dorchester, Trevor Simpson, set to ride. Race six, here at ASD, post time, seven minutes. They're set. Check that. Farmhand still in behind the gate. One farmhand, a little unsettled. He's in. And they're off. First leg of the ASD Marathon Series. Lukeva from the center of the track with Sartorialist. Angling down over to the rail, double clutch. Tucking in behind, that's Smarty Fawcett. To the center of the track, Pentecost. Far outside, Starpone and uh, Farmhand. By the grandstand for the first time, Lukeva, an unhurried pace, has it three parts of a length. Sartorialist right there at flank from second, two and a half back to Smarty Fawcett who moves together with double clutch in third and fourth, respectively. Star Pone will follow from fifth, only four lengths off the lead. Gaps about five to Pentecost and back to Farmhand, who spots the pace setters ten. Midway through the clubhouse turn, Lou Cava now establishes the advantage of full length. Sartorialist from second once again will engage him. Uh, to the outside, Smarty Fawcett down to the rail, double clutch. A uh, length and a half back to Star Pone. About three lengths now to Pentecost and a further three back to Farmhand. They're by the half in 49 and three. Reasonable pace. They pass the midpoint of the backstretch. Down to the rail, Luke Cava. Now right alongside Sartorialist. They've got a length and a half to double clutch in Smarty Fawcett. Two and three quarters back to Star Pone. It's going to have to pick it up down to the rail. Pentecost. Farmhand continues to bide his time at the back of the pack. Into the far turn they go, and Sartorialist goes by to get the lead. Uh, motivated, Smarty Fawcett now from the center of the track. Down to the rail, and Luke Kiva trying to pick it up. Double clutch, they approach the head of the lane. Sartorialist will lead them home. Well meant from the center of the track is Smarty Fawcett, and down the stretch they come. Uh, in the final eighth of a mile, Sartorialist, his race to lose. He's got it by three. Uh, to the center of the track, Pentecost picks it up belatedly. Down to the rail, and Smarty Fawcett, but the win is not in doubt. Sartorialist for trainer Fred Ross and Ronaldo Cumberbatch grabs his second of the night, gets it done in the first leg. Back to Smarty Fawcett, close for show. Now in the winner's enclosure, the winner of race six here at ASD, the first leg of the marathon series, the winner number five, Sartorialist. Tutorialist four-year-old uh, Chestnut Gelding by, rather, Gray Gelding by finality out of the mare. Gray, Toby Free by Free at last. Stone to trim by Fred Ross and rid to victory by Ronaldo Cumberbatch. Mile and an eighth in 153 and four. The mile time in that race was 141 and two. 
Congratulations goes out to jockey Ronaldo Cumberbatch, who scores his second win on this evening's card. Two wins for jockey Ronaldo Cumberbatch. Six is official here with the prices five. Satorial has 15.70 to win, 5.20 to place, 4.50 to show.